बिल्कुल ब्रेक 2013 मतलब टू बी ऑनस्ट मुझे इतनी चीज़ें याद नहीं है लेकिन मुझे ये याद है कि 2013 के बाद ई एक्स डी ने ब्रेक ली थी uh, और वो ब्रेक वी वी काइंड ऑफ बिल्ड अप द ब्रेक तो ऐसा नहीं था कि हाँ भाई ब्रेक ले ले रहे लेकिन वी ग्रो इन टू इट यू नो सम थिंग्स वर नॉट वर्किंग आउट एंड या एंड सिकंदर के घर पे प्रैक्टिस भी थोड़ी वो हुई थी कम हो गई थी खैर तो ये चीज़ें थी भाई फिर क्या हुआ फिर ये हुआ कि जो है एक वक्त आया जिसके अंदर जो है ना दे वॉज दे वॉज सम आर्ग्यूमेंट और सम मिसअंडरस्टैंडिंग बिटवीन डोन मी ब्रांडन मिकायल सिरल तो अपेंटली हमारा कोई जाति नहीं था लेकिन एवरीबडी वॉज कनेक्टेड अपेंटली दो हिस्सों में डिवाइड हो गया क्रू ब्रेक एक टेक्निकली हो ही गया था जिसके अंदर डोइन मी एंड सरल वॉज एट वन साइड और मिकाइल एंड ब्रैंड एंड मॉरिस वॉज एट वन साइड कोई इसमें कोई यू नो दे वॉज नो बिग फाइड ओवर इट बट कोई मिस अंडरस्टैंडिंग की वजह से यू नो वी ट्राइड एवरी थिंग टू मेक श्योर के थिंग्स यू नो गेट सॉर्ट आउट इन अ वे कि जिससे हम सारे यूनाइट हो सकें बट वी कूडन टू दैट फॉर क्वाइट सम टाइम और इट वॉज pretty hard and pretty weird because everyone was scattered and which, which was not a good thing and we never experienced that uh, you know in that since since long so bada thoda ajeeb sa wo hisab ke data so we tried everything but we couldn't uh, pull that off doen had a tournament he held a tournament in act 1 doen by this time hasan is gone he's done whatever the crap he had to do and he's left he's ditched everybody and he's left the country or we wap for a movie the movie uh, uh, we didn't do the movie the movie still got made and everything called dance kaani just by the way one in yu chong is in it uh his wife is in it too so uh we regardless of that movie i don't think it really mattered we just took a, a month we blew off yeah we didn't do it we didn't do the movie but uh we got contacted uh twain wanted to do a tournament in act 1 he arranged belts and everything he wa- he made everything Unknown crew won that tournament. Okay, the the solos, Kevin's solos. Unknown crew took cruise. They didn't even face us in the finals. They faced Street Dreamers crew. We got kicked out in the first round as a crew. In the duos, me and Brandon reached the final, and in the solos, Brandon reached the final. He lost to Kevin. But I remember this as clear as day when I competed. The finals were Dwayne. Uh, sorry, the finals were Kevin, Christy, uh, and Tipu. I I don't remember his first name. His actual name. Kevin Christian Tipu versus Mikhail and Brandon versus Morris and Adil. It was a three-way cipher, and uh, I felt like we won. Like, like Adil and Morris had nothing on us. Kevin and Tipu didn't do that great. I like Brandon. We got this. We're winning. We just sat down. We held each other's hands, and we were like, "Give us the vote. Give us the vote. We're about to win. We're about to win." I was so confident, but I didn't get the vote. And I've watched that clip back so many times. I don't. I don't even think I have it today. But we didn't get the vote, and I told Duane, "Why didn't we get the vote?" Uh, prior to this, the conversation me and Duane had the day before. Uh, it was my brother's birthday, also the day before. And the night when I went back to Duane's house after my brother's birthday, I asked him that uh, if there is any conspiracy, because I'm telling you, it, it had become a thing. It was repetitively happening in a lot of tournaments. It was, it was, it was a thing. It was happening way too often. I asked him if there's a conspiracy, if there's any favoritism, or you know, people are just. Voting for the people just because they're bored of watching us at practice. Literally, one of them said this to us that I've seen you guys at practice and I don't enjoy watching you at practice. That's why I voted for the other crew because I've seen them so much at practice and uh, then I see the same thing at the tournament. I I would that's why I voted for the other crew. Why are you coming to our practices? How can you judge us like that? That's so stupid. Anyway, they're supposed to judge us in comparison to the other crew, not a comparison to what you've seen prior and what you're seeing right now. Like. I don't get me started. The that wasn't the excuse I was given. I just asked Dwayne. I said, "What are you going to do about it?" He's like, "Nothing. The tournament's over. These guys won, and uh, that's pretty much it. I'm not be changing anything. I just stood. I remember. I just told Dwayne, 'I'm done. Screw you. Screw your crew. I'm out.' You know, when they all got eliminated, and you know, like Brandon really pushed himself, and when Brandon got eliminated, I kind of didn't. I didn't abuse my power. I should have. I mean, coming to the factor of realizing now that the people that I wanted to, you know, grow a friendship with or grow a bond with, they didn't want that. They just wanted the spotlight. And if I had to be a little bit more selfish and look after my crew more than trying to build a name in the community, I probably would not have lost my friends for that whole one year. But 
I think that's why we went down south and Mikhail and I stopped talking and I st- I cut ties with a lot of the guys. I was on my own for a while. But that was my wake up call, you know. That was where I realized that you know exactly the way shit went down with Donald was because he st- stopped thinking about the crew and you know the crew took that decision. So I think it was that point in 2013 when I just became Donald, you know. I stopped thinking about the crew and I was only thinking about myself. I didn't really think about the fact that you know everybody else has an opinion too that should have mattered. And yeah, it it, it just built a lot of hatred. We we kind of imploded. This is where instead of imploding, we just imploded. And the entire crew just went its own way. You know, nobody was wanting to be around each other anymore considering the fact that we were all together every day for 2 years. We kind of just got fed up of having everybody around because resentment just got built between all of us and we all had our own opinions that mattered more than just as a team opinion itself during the time that uh, mikhail and duane split up me and duane had some uh, bit of a problem as well uh now obviously if uh, he was on on a negative point at that point he had negative vibes going on i'm not sure what what is happening but i uh, think started to get heated up between us so that really cut me off from duane for a while as well we've been away for like a year or so um in the meanwhile what happened i was uh meeting up with mikhail and uh, we used to chill out a lot um we used to sit uh, day and nights outside uh, just talking and everything and at uh, that time morris uh, was used to be with us a lot so we, Yeah, you should have fun nights at that time. So, it doesn't really matter whether you split or whether you are back together because back in those days, uh, Dwayne uh, completely cut cut off from EXD. Okay, uh, some of the guys were with Dwayne, some of the guys were with Mikael. I was with Mikael. Okay, now obviously in a crew, you do have ups and downs. Okay, you have those. uh things where you cannot cope up or where you know you expect the other person is getting pissed off for some xyz reason so uh yet again back in those days uh you know there was there was no talking about exd crew okay for a good one or two years all right but obviously ups and downs are in every crew you know they split they come back together they come back together stronger right so yeah i was with mikhail that time and duane was completely out of exd uh exd crew like it was uh, i would say there was no exd existence okay exd did not exist for a good 2 years right so we yeah, had the crew split there was no exd i was just me brand and morris and duane said and said and that was some me brand and morris were me brand and morris and sekandar was uh, Lot with Sid and all, even him, him and I had a falling out. Uh, Don and Larry were to be seen doing their own thing. The XD was over in 2013, just over from 2013 to 20. I don't even know where Adil is in this whole situation. He started with me. We went along. We did a couple of shows. We formed a crew called the Team, which we'll hear about in later on. But that's it. 